Hey everybody, all right, Zane from Real Easy AI, and we're gonna do an audio in 10 minutes or less. I just got done doing a big five-part series. I wanna do a quick and dirty one for folks who only have a few minutes to learn it. Bottom line, audio is used to create music, and if you wanna create music, it's real simple to do. Uh, you can literally start as soon as you log in right at the top, just typing in a prompt of any kind, whatever it is you wanna do. In my case, I'll say a post-modern funk um, song about uh, youthful angst uh, in the style of Rage Against the Machine. And we'll give that a shot. Uh, now, you can do comma and you can add things. So I'm going to do comma, alternative rock. Um, and also you got it down here, alternative metal, alternative indie, alternative. I'll just do alternative. And you can add uh, additional tags as well. So I'm going to go with that. Click on, uh, notice it's going to do 30 seconds by default. I can do two minutes. Auto-generated or instrumental. Uh, I want auto-generated because I want lyrics, of course. And uh, we can do advanced creation controls, but that's uh, we'll get into that in a second. Let's click on create. I'm going to pause while it creates. Okay, it's done. Let's take a look. Let's see what we got. Unleashed fury and awakening the fire. Let's hear it. That sounds like speed metal. Let's try the other one. In this maze of modern life, what's real? Sounds a little like Stone Temple Pilots, but not Rage Against the Machine. Very interesting. Um, we could keep generating uh, variants, but I want to move on from there. So um, now that we're here, one of the things we can do is go to the advanced controls. And in the advanced controls, some of the things you can do, for example, are, uh, let's say we want to change the lyrics. Instead of auto-generated lyrics, under lyrics, I can say custom. And, of course, I'm going to steal some Rage Against the Machine lyrics. I'm not going to publish this, so I should be good. Up, oh, oh, violates terms of use. ChatGPT won't give it to me. That's fine. Let's, uh, I'll look it up real quick, and then I'll be right back. All right, there we go. Uh, the lyrics to There Be No Shelter here. I'm going to go ahead and grab that. And I, I like all this. Boom, boom, boom. I'm just grab all this and see what it can create. All right. And we're going to go with a two-minute song on this deal. We're going to use the Udio 130. I do have the standard plan, so I get a lot of extra stuff. You would normally get. Uh, I'm pasting in the lyrics now, so I got the lyrics in. Let's see what it can do. I'm going to click on. Uh, let's see. We still postmodern funk, youthful, blah blah blah. I think we're in good shape. And create. All right. I'm going to go ahead and uh, pause it while it creates, and let's see what we got. Okay. So look what happened. Uh, error while generating track. Copyrighted lyrics. It figured out that the lyrics were copyrighted and isn't going to let me use them. I think that's a good thing. So uh, we'll come up with some different lyrics uh, in just a minute here and try something different. Okay, I changed the lyrics up a bit with the help of ChatGPT. Let's uh, create again, see what we got. All right, let's see what we got. Here we go. Uh, chasing illusions and illusions of freedom. Attraction, many attraction. Now you got to tell your number is stone. And see your pockets, man, I got you. Oh, send the trees, make you think it's all shit about a that is closer. I like that. Let's see how this one looks. Distraction, man, attraction. Numb you down until your number's stone. Empty your pockets, man, and they catch your hooks. Stun you disguise as rebellion. Okay, I think we can live with that. So there you go. So you can begin creating. Um, uh, one of the nice things, though, that you can do is you can switch it over. So right now, whenever you give it a prompt, it rewrites the prompt for you. And I thought we got some pretty good results. But now what I'm going to do is switch it, over, <clears throat> switch it over into manual mode because I was pretty precise with my prompt and I really wanted to follow the prompt more directly and not rewrite it. So we're going to switch into manual mode, click on create, and we'll create a couple more instances and see if we get better results. Okay, uh, now we did manual mode, so it's going to follow the prompt more precisely and not rewrite it. Let's see what we get. Illusion of freedom and create chasing illusions. Destruction! Main attraction. No, that's no good. Let's try this one. That traction, main attraction. Numb you up, boss, and I mask. So let's true. No, I don't think I like either one of those. Okay, so in this case, a lot of times, more precise you are, manual mode will give you better results, but in this case, it really didn't. 
Okay, um, let's take a look at some other options that we have. The one thing I really wish they had was like a clear button. That'd be nice too. But at any rate, let's go ahead then and uh, we will uh, try to begin a new creation. See, there's not a, not a new button here, so I've just got to clear everything out. Give me a second here. I'll get it all cleared out. In addition to songs with lyrics, you can also create instrumentals and even do custom lyrics, uh, which is what we did. Uh, but you can do auto-generated li lyrics as well. So if you want to do instrumentals, you can do that. If you want to do auto-generated lyrics and not worry about lyrics, you can do that. And you can do the custom lyrics like we just showed. So there's a lot, a lot of flexibility in terms of what you can do here. Now, there are some advanced features. Let me go to the new model here. There are some advanced features you can take advantage of. Just model choice, uh, prompt strength, lyric strength. Some other things that you can do, whether or not you know, where you want the lyrics to come in at and the generation quality. These have minor tweaks to the song that you create. The two biggest ones probably being lyric timing where you can decide you know, how, if you want the lyrics to come in right away or come in later. And then clarity, um, when we crank this all the way up, it definitely... Uh, is not a good thing. It tends to have certain instruments take over uh, and drown out the other stuff that's going on. So play with these. Uh, there's a lot of different settings here. I suggest you get started with auto-generated and just try a few prompts or you can click on the little dice here to generate random prompts. All right. Um, the other thing is uh, you will have a library of music that you create. There are options to work with the songs that you create, remix them, extend them, and then paint them. Um, uh, also, you can do it, I believe, with songs that you just see out in the wild. Uh, so there's not only songs you make, but you can see songs that are out there. If you go to the home page, uh, you'll see things like staff picks, trending songs, and on it goes. And you can actually pick one of the songs. Let's pick this one softly and tenderly. Uh, let's see. Uh, let's try a different one. This one looks pretty freaky. Let's, let's see here. Whoops. Let's click on that. Hang on. Let's try that. There we go. Um, and so you can come in here. You can click on create. And then you can say remix or extend this song. Um, or even copy the prompt that was used to create this song. So maybe uh, I like the song. Let's see here. Whoops. That's not what I wanted. Okay, I dig that, but maybe I want to remix a little bit of it or extend it in some way. I can do all of that here. I can come into remix. I can pick a portion of it. I want to remix whatever that happens to be. I'll just remix the start of it. Um, and uh, then it's got some custom stuff going on here. Yeah, I don't care about that. We'll do instrumental and we will click on remix. See what we got. Okay, we've got our uh, remix here. We'll share the original. And one of the settings down here was the variance. We had very similar, um, not a similar, uh, a little less similar, about halfway. Then you can have very different and extremely different. We decided to do about halfway here on this particular song. Let's listen to the first remix. Okay. You can tell it's throwing in a few extra things. All right, let's listen to the second one. I'm not a fan of that first one. Interesting. It's got some piano stuff going on there. So there you go. Um, lots and lots of cool things you can do with this. Play with it yourself. Uh, as you begin creating things, you'll find songs that other people make you like. You'll find songs that you create. You can publish them. You can even use them for commercial purposes, believe it or not. There is a ton of stuff you can do with this. Once you're happy with something, of course, always remember to post it to Twitter or X, if you will, Instagram, Discord, wherever you want to go for it. Uh, go nuts. There's a lot of great things you can do. This is really democratizing song creation for those who maybe don't know how to create songs. Now you can create songs. 
They may not be Grammy winners or anything, but they're going to be good songs. I created a few I'm pretty happy with, and you're hearing some pretty cool stuff going on here. Play with Udio. It's fun. I think you'll like it. This is Zane. I'll see you next time.